Three former cabinet secretaries and the former state house controller appeared before the Defense and Foreign Relations Committee to defend their nomination for ambassadorial positions. Faced with questions on how he handled his duties at the sports docket, Hassan Wario absolved himself of any wrongdoing, especially in the Rio Olympic scandal. The issue of uh, Rio was investigated by various bodies. And Mr. Chairman, uh, when we came from Rio, we were called by the parliament, uh, the Committee for Labor and Social Service, led by uh, Mr. Uh, Honorable Were. We were called twice by that committee. We laid the facts. I'm sure the report is somewhere here. We were also called by the Senate Committee, um, by, which was led by Stuart Mazayo, and we were called twice by them. Uh, following that, there was also a comprehensive report which was written by an independent uh, committee uh, led by one Professor Chiang, who is a sports expert from Strathmore University, uh, and the committee comprised of um, you know, top journalists in sports and so on and so forth. Um, and then the CID came. They investigated, and they left more than one year ago. Wario, who has been nominated for Kenya's ambassador to Austria, said he will strive to reinvigorate Kenya's relations with Austria. Before his transfer to the Lance docket, Jacob Kaimenya encountered numerous runoffs with teachers' unions. MPs branding Kaimenya a hardliner, one whose ability to amicably resolve disputes was highly questionable. To insinuate that we really don't recognize uh, contrary opinion is not true. People intent on their own opinion and honor of chair. I think it's only to respect everybody, even the deaf, even the blind and the dumb have to be listened to. That is me. I don't discriminate because you are when Mundus or somebody else, no, I don't. Kaimenyi has been nominated to represent Kenya at the United Nations Education, Scientific and Cultural Organization in Paris, France. Willie Bet, who has been nominated to head Kenya's mission in India, said he plans to help Kenya tap into India's enormous wealth in medicine to help reduce trips Kenyans make to the Asian country for treatment. I want to believe a situation where a, an hospital consultant in New Delhi, for example, can run a procedure in Kenya using technology and even uh, building a communication between experts in Kenya and experts, say that areas where they don't have the expertise can be guided through telephone or technology. I'm told even surgery can be done in that manner. After spending decades in the provincial administration and a few years as state house controller, Lawrence Nayapa is looking to represent Kenya as an ambassador in the Netherlands. I will do my best to ensure that uh, the interests of this country and, and the dream of his second the president of the, on, on the uh, big four is realized. Lenayapa was, however, asked to respond to allegations that he took part in the alleged extrajudicial killings of proscribed Mungiki sect members during his service in Kiambu County. I, I, have, I have never participated in, in, in extra, extrajudicial killing. So if I was a culprit, then if I was culpable, I am sure the House will have called me, having served in Kiambu at that time. Lenayapa promised to introduce value addition to Kenya's horticulture to boost the export of flowers to Netherlands should he be approved for appointment. The 21 nominees who are vetted on Wednesday and Thursday now await Parliament's decision on whether to approve or reject their nomination. For Channel 1 News, I am Edward Kabaza.